Item number SCP-377 Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures SCP-377 is kept in the personnel break room, third cabinet to the left of the refrigerator. Any personnel desiring a cookie from SCP-377 may take one, and only one cookie every 48 hours, to ensure that all personnel get a share. Personnel read their fortunes at their own risk. SCP-377 is a box of LaChoy brand fortune cookies. The box was full when it was recovered from and has since restocked itself regularly every 12 hours. The cookies within the box are individually wrapped, for freshness according to the box, and are, according to all tests, totally ordinary. Each cookie contains one 18mm by 58mm piece of paper, on which a fortune is written in blue ink. All of these properties are consistent with a box of cookies from this brand. However, the fortunes contained within each cookie are not consistent with those provided by the standard product. Fortunes appear to be specific to the individual opening the cookie, and have thus far shown to be 100% accurate, ranging from vague indications of coming success to specific predictions regarding personnel's personal lives. The fortunes are not, however, always positive. It is unknown whether the fortune cookies actively predict future events or in fact cause future events to occur. Document number 377-01 the following is a partial log of some of the more notable fortunes given out by SCP-377. Fortune text. It's a boy. Corresponding result. Subject's wife's water broke less than an hour later. The child was male. Fortune text. The weather is really just not your friend today. Corresponding result. Subject was struck by lightning later on the same day. Subject made a full recovery. Fortune text. Keep playing. You're going to win soon. Corresponding result. Subject was a regular player in the state lottery, buying two lottery tickets a week. Four weeks after receiving this fortune, subject won over 100 million US dollars. Fortune text. Life is laughter. Enjoy it while you can. Corresponding result. Subject suffered an aneurysm leading to massive hemorrhaging and sudden death. This occurred while subject was laughing. Fortune text. Duck. Corresponding result. Addendum. Following SCP-377's prediction of the deaths of several personnel, a request was submitted to upgrade SCP-377's class to Keter. These were denied, citing a lack of evidence that SCP-377 had any actual connection to the causes of the deaths. Addendum. Doctor Received a fortune reading. You don't have long to live. Doctor was then startled by a guard who entered the break room and began to choke on the cookie. The guard did not know the Heimlich maneuver, and Dr. tragically suffocated and died. This has been regarded as an accident and coincidence. Note from Agent I strongly discourage the recreational use of SCP-377. Knowing the future sucks all the fun out of life. Believe me, I know.